What's your name? And where were you born? So am I, huh? In Copenhagen, 23rd of June, 1927. Denmark? Copenhagen. Well, I know. Yeah. Um, what did your parents do? Uh, my father was working in a large restaurant. Uh, my mother was uh, a cloakroom attendant. Is that how they met? Pardon? Is that how they met? Uh, no, they met when my mother started as um, making uh, open sandwiches in the same restaurant as my father worked. Your dad was married, actually, right? Yes. When you were born? I don't know. Yes, I think so. Mm. Yes, he was. That's uh, a... <laughs> <laughs> Dice, isn't it? Oh, his name, um, Jan, I think. Yes. My cousin told me that you walked to your parents' wedding. No, we walked to our confirm uh, Christmas. Christmas. We didn't watch their wedding, though. I don't remember them. I don't remember going to their wedding at all. But you could have been old enough. We could have been old enough. Okay. About two ish. All right. I would say. Did Jan tell you that? Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> what was it like being a girl in Denmark? Uh, what was it like? It was alright. Um, do you want me to talk about the war? Well, eventually, you know, you can ah, work yeah. on um, We weren't the uh, well off. Um, we had sweets once a week. Um, clothes were really hard to come by because we couldn't afford to buy any. But my mother was really good with her hands and she made all our clothes. It came uh, when we were confirmed. Uh, she made our confirmation outfit. Your mother was Swedish, wasn't she? Half. Okay. Yeah. Rosenkrantz. Rosenkrantz. That was your mother's maiden name? Yes. Was there any relation to the... Uh... We don't know that. Okay. I wish my brother had your being touch. When um, it's difficult when you have to go on to another country to find out these things. Right. But these are flags somewhere. In one of the museums, oh, yeah. um, we used to go to um, Sweden um, for holidays from our parents. I remember once we went right up to the top, north mm -hmm. of Sweden. How'd you go there? Trains? Um, no, it wasn't cars. Oh, right. And uh, I remember my um, my grandma. No, my great grandma, um, and she had to go up a, a ladder to her house. It was on stilts. I should imagine. Because of water and stuff. Pardon? Because of water. Why was it on stilts? I don't know. I just remember. And this was in Sweden. This sticks in my mind. Yes, in Sweden. And uh, she was a really fit. You remember the town? What town? It no, was? I don't remember the town. Okay. Um, but she was she lived till she was ninety. Before, of course, uh, my father went to America. Uh -huh. Before. Um, before you were born. My mother. Right. Before I met my mother. Um, in fact, before he got married. The first yep. time. He was in New York. He went to New York. Yes, he did all sorts of um, jobs, but he didn't get rid of farm. Uh, with anything, he didn't make a, um, a career uh -huh. at all. And uh, then he was called home because uh, his mother was boy. Is that where he learned to speak English? Or did he not speak? Yes, yeah. he, he learned it in America. Mm -hmm. And uh, then he started in the restaurant trade. You're saying that you went up on horse and cart. Were there any cars? Not a lot. Not a lot in those days. That was 1930s, I would say, something like that. Um, well, we did go to Sweden quite a lot, although I couldn't understand what my cousin said, speaking Swedish. Do you speak any Swedish? No. But they do in Denmark now a lot. Oh, they do? Because uh, they can get programs on television uh -huh. um, from Sweden, and uh, the Danish uh, television is just rubbish. So they watch a lot of Swedish yeah. television. Um, 